Hello and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. This is Kazoro. Um, since last time, I go went ahead and traveled back to underneath Dynamite General because you know I've been here before. You guys know how to get here, and that's where this class was taking us. Also, the uh, Rat Ghouls just outside there. Um, I killed them to get in, and I started getting a bonus. So sorry, you missed the beginning of the bonus. But that's where we're at. Okay, so we need to kill a bunch of these rat ghouls and recover the serum. Now, you may notice I've got my kid on my lap. Um, yeah, so if I have to stop and you know, let him up or down or play with him for a few seconds, that's all I'm doing. Alright, so now we got to recover some serum. There's some right here in this storage case thing. Let's get some and hope it doesn't ruin our bonus, but if it does, we're the head on levels anyway. We've been running the bounty quests. Okay, got it. Um, we're gonna head upstairs real quick. See if we can't find a lore object or two. I know there are lore objects around here. I don't remember. Oh, yep, there's the one. That's the one I was trying to remember. I'm lucky you don't even get a... It doesn't even count for the bonus. That sucks. Get that debuff on him. My burn going, and I'll lay into him with Master Strike and Slash. Keep that burn on him. There you go. Not too bad. And here's the lore object. Awesome. Um, need to go find five more rackles. There are groups of you know little rackles that I can kill that are around here. Don't really want to fight a bunch of silvers. This looks promising. Yeah, that's right. Shh. Okay. Um, I need one more, and then I will quick travel out of here. Look. Perfect. Oh, never mind. Not perfect. Okay, let's quick travel back. Welcome back. Let's get those serum samples analyzed and see what we've got. Well, thank the Force for good Teresian storage technology. I wasn't sure anything would still be viable after three centuries. While we wait, is there a cost to these samples I should be aware of? A deal with a pirate crew, perhaps? There were difficulties, but the Force was with us. You make it sound so easy. Ah, here we are. Fortunately, the plague is so virulent, it cultures very rapidly. Hmm, bad news. The serum you recovered looks like it was effective 300 years ago, but the Raku Plague has mutated since then. This serum will only provide effective immunity for extraordinarily healthy individuals. No one's going to take an unreliable vaccine. Yes, but it gives us options. Right now, I need what we call a lucky survivor, whose system has antibodies to the modern plague. 
haven't had a survivor yet, for obvious reasons, but this serum might provide the link we need. If I infected an extraordinary individual protected by the serum, I could collect the antibodies and make an effective vaccine. If it means we can someday wipe those things from the planet, sign me up. Well, and I have this whole speech ready. All right, we have a medical droid, CB-084, set up to observe Rakul's in the field. He'll be able to collect the antibodies and slow any potential complications. After I give you the serum, go out there and test it. Let the Rakul's attack you and see what happens. Inject me and let's get going. Here you go. I hope the force is with you because the science is stretched to the limit. All right, so we've got to uh, go get infected by the rack holes on purpose. We have an hour and a half to do it. It only takes me about two or three minutes. And then after we're infected, we just got to go down and see this other medical droid down there who will check our body for antibodies and whatever else they're looking for to see how this serum affects us. Alright, so you want rat in this area, but you want red rat ghouls. You want them to attack you, so let's just get these guys done with. Because they're not going to matter much anyway. We need a red rat ghoul, that guy. Alright, so if I tell... Now let's just jump in. T7 on follow mode. There. I can turn T7 off of follow mode. And we're good to go. Don't find my son over there, we just turned on... Star Wars The Clone Wars, Episode 1. Season 1, Episode 1. And it's got Yoda in it, and my son is crazy about Yoda. Alright, and the timer's off, now that you've been infected. It's really that easy to get infected. Just go find one of these red guys up here, and get his attention, but then don't attack him. And, you know, cake. I've heard of some people having problems getting infected, but I've never had a problem getting infected. When I do it like that, just find the red guy and attack him once, and let him attack me. Okay, so now we're heading to the south here to report to CB084 and investigate Dr. Godera's lab. Let's turn off this heroic for now. Uh, that is intriguing. Yeah, sure. I could always use more gathering resources. Get it, T7. Okay. So we got the datacron here, we got the datacron over there. Okay. <coughs> yep, Yoda's on the screen, so he's screaming at him. Funny thing, too, my uh, older son. I was two, I think, when my youngest was born, and he was saying that we should name him Yoda. So that turned out pretty funny. That he likes Yoda so much. Okay, down into the Brel Sediment. Yeah, to go down to Waypoint Station Dre, and that's where the next. <coughs> set of missions it's going to come from. Oh gosh, let me up there. I just want my crystal. Excuse me. Okay. Nope, oh, and there's a mission right here to pick up too. Awesome. Awesome. 
a Ethiopi. What who na the boat that done we want to what over Jakanuka? The goalie G what a hoopa, goalie ra what a wampa. What else can you tell me? I don't want to go kill you, what the fuck? Talk about the girl, you are the. Who could you be? But one and you bobo chop a duma. Finish your mission, and you'll honor your squadron's sacrifice. Cava tuta omiska, cava des pameta. Who could you be, chunky? Fakota ji auto endia. I will not leave you waiting long. What do you? So how the punyo is the water? Say grotto will be you be. We bani yaka tripi ta boka tonka wana waka. I almost forgot I needed those thermionic gel suspensions. That's what I'm waiting for before I craft the next level of hilts and whatever. Okay. CB. Ah, I see your infection is progressing. Hold still while I take samples for analysis. While I transmit the data to Dr. Cell, there are some questions I should ask. Do you have any of the following symptoms? Dizziness, fever, shortness of breath, an inexhaustible hunger for sentient flesh. I could go for a Nerf burger. That doesn't count, right? I will note it on your chart. Ah, here's Dr. Cell. Good news. Your antibody count is off the charts. I'll start work on a vaccine immediately. You are remarkably brave. Our progress has just jumped forward by years. While you recuperate, I'm going to transmit the usual secrecy agreements. Just use your thumbprint to sign on the sensor. What do you mean, usual secrecy agreements? This is standard procedure when the Republic develops biotech with significant earnings potential. We develop the vaccine for Republic soldiers first, and when it's proven, sell it to colonists. Until then, it's under wraps. We don't want the Exchange or the Sith funding some horrible operation with an underground version. Lives will be lost while this profit is being made. Tell me something I don't know. Every week we hear another Rakul horror story. But every colonist on the planet is going to want this vaccine. How do I tell my superiors we gave up that kind of money? If you get a sample to the Jedi, I bet they'd find someone to make it fast. I'll keep that in mind. We'll get this cure out one way or another. Thanks for putting yourself on the line for this. It would have taken years to do it the safe way. I don't know if Taurus will ever be what it was, but now, at least, there's hope. Well, let's see if I need it, because I only have one piece of gear. It's 46 rating. Yeah, I don't need it. So I'll just take the basic commendation. Alright, um... Yeah, it looks like I just gotta pick up some of these quests around here. I'm not sure if the, what happened to the planet quests, but... Yeah, whatever. What do you think, Karn? The foundation of the Terrace Chemworks factory cannot be repaired. I expect total collapse within two weeks. Once the building falls, the stored chemicals will flood this area. They are... 
highly toxic to humans. I am sorry. I'll make sure there are speeders on hand, but we can't just pack up and go. Do as you can. As always, I will pursue an alternative. Master Jedi, forgive my inattentiveness. I am honored by your presence, though I advise you not to stay long. You were talking about evacuation. What's going on? Many of these ruins are unstable. A nearby structure used for chemical storage is on the verge of crumbling. As I was explaining to my colleague, there is only one way to remove the chemicals before they spill. A burn-off. A well-armed demolitions team could reach the structure and incinerate the chemical stockpiles. I can provide the incendiaries. Unfortunately, no team is available. Why don't you let me deal with this? Your generosity is considerable. You should know, however. Between the structural instability, the toxicity levels, and the incendiary chemicals, the mission does carry substantial risk. It is nonetheless urgent. You are not a demolitions team, I fully recognize this. But if you could arrange the burn-off, I would humbly welcome your aid. Master Jedi, please, excuse my abruptness. The Republic told me you might be able to help with the difficult situation. They say you are our most reliable operative on Terrace. Have you heard anything about titroxinate being sold on the black market? It's rare for a Jedi to be consulted about the black market. I suppose that's true. My apologies, Master Jedi. Titroxinate was the pre patent name for the weaponized agent we think was responsible for the Rakgul Plague. The Empire could fashion it into a terrible weapon, turning our soldiers into monsters and setting them against us. Where's the arms dealer who's selling this stuff? I'm more worried about his source. Trace the original titroxinate samples to an old Chemworks factory. It's overrun with Nexu. We can't get near it. If you can retrieve any canisters that remain, the Republic will see you're well rewarded for your effort. Looks like I could still use a few more thermionic gel suspensions, but what's holding me back is the sacred artifact fragments. Those will just find while I'm questing. So, yeah, what's this look like? Uh, rating 50. Do I want some of that? Uh, I got rating 50, 10, and 7. Yeah, because I took the lower level one. That might help. 7, no, 6. I created myself might help 6s. That are blue. So I guess they're identical to two levels up as green. But yeah, there you go. Well, since I can't do anything else, might as well craft that. Just wait for more of that, and when possible, get thermionic gel suspensions from here. But it's not possible right now. Okay. Let's go pick up this last quest here. And we'll see about. Running all these quests. Master Jedi, what brings you to our small corner of Republic space? This is such a great, great honor. Even a forgotten planet can harbor dark secrets. Oh, whatever brings you here, I suggest you don't stay long. We barely got stores enough for our station soldiers, much less visitors. At this rate, I've got men scalping ration cubes for a half week's salary. If the outpost's in trouble, I'd be happy to help. I just might take you up on that. Our bases here are far from self-sufficient. We're not farmers, and there's no existing infrastructure here to work with. We're at the mercy of our supply ships, and this month's just went nose down in some of the worst territory on Terrace. Where's the ship? I don't care if it's at the bottom of a swamp. The Republic thanks you for your service. Our men tried to reach the ship once, but they turned back after taking serious casualties. They said it's more than just rat ghouls, but couldn't make an ID. 
you still want to go, you'll need to talk to our quartermaster at the supply shed across the base. She's got the exact coordinates of the crash. And you're just going to make this all better, huh? Usually, people are happy if I come to make things better. I'm Karen Wet, Quartermaster. Commander Gardet just called to say you're retrieving our supplies. For which, by the way, I and the rest of the troops here humbly thank you. But I don't want Commander Fat Pants to think it means he gets away with this. Steal from your troops, waste Republic money bringing in silks and wine from Alderaan, and it's fine, because some wandering Jedi will happen in to save you. That's a serious accusation. I said over and over that the ship needed repairs. The left stasis generator was loose, and the hyperdrive motivator was seeping fluid. But Gardet had already spent our allotted maintenance budget on himself. Do you have any doubts about this whatsoever? I'm telling the truth. Somehow he's juggling the numbers he sends to HQ. No commander needs a personal vehicle in an outpost this size. If you can take this hollow camera out to the crash site, you could get the evidence I need to get him court-martialed. When you put it that way, how can I refuse? Thank you. If you take hollow pics of the engine, I can show that the documented lack of repairs is what caused the crash. The most important thing is the supplies, though. The crash site isn't far. When you get everything, bring it back here so I can distribute it. Alright, well, we've got our missions. So let's head down and start taking care of them. And can't wait till I have enough money to buy speeder piloting. Or till I get high enough level, which only happens in three more levels, so. Might not even be worth it to do anything yet. Alright, let's head down to the south first, I think. Wait. No, because there's a mission right here, I swear. Let's try heading down to this area first. Maybe that'll turn into the other mission that handles the pirates that are right there. Yeah. We're just going to check it out. Um, boom. Alarm crystals. Go get it, T7. I'll take my buffs. Thank you very much. I think I'll get that, T7. Uh, looks like I can head down here and veer to the left. Get what I need. This is for uh, that biology scanning, whatever. Okay. Bog stalkers. No. No bog stalkers, but we did not get a bonus for it, so I'll just kill the necessary ones. get into the engine there so we can get the picture and prove that he was embezzling funds or whatever. Oh, sacred, that's what I need for this level of crafting. Level 23, uh, nothing new there. So it'll just be a level of blade storm and transcendence. Transcendence is great for group PVE and for PvP. 
but it's not so good for soloing. You don't really need it when you're soloing. Alright, I'm just going to quick travel back there. Because I have a quick travel. My cooldown's only four minutes right now, so I'll be fine. Antibiotics. They come on the same ship as everything else. You're supposed to keep better tabs on that sort of thing. These men have the Cillian flu. They could die if... Master Jedi, dare I hope you've made it to our ship? I've brought what you requested. Just in the nick of time, too. The men came close to mutiny when I cut rations again. Uh, they knew this wasn't going to be a luxury cruise. What do you expect? You ask your men to starve while you eat Bantha steaks from off-world. These pictures prove you knew the ship was damaged, and you sent it anyway. They're going to Republic Command, along with my documentation of every personal purchase you've made. These men left their families and risked their lives to come here. If they die, it should be for someone better than you. I... I didn't know the ship was so bad. I thought if it was serious, they'd catch it on Ord Mantel. A good commander lives under the same conditions as his troops. I never realized how quickly we go through our supplies. If I thought we couldn't last a month, I... I have some uh, personal stores. I I'll distribute them while you finish here, as a gesture of good faith. I never thought I'd see anyone put the righteous fear into him like that. Good job, and thank you. Actually, if you're still interested in serving our soldiers, there may be something else. Normally, our fourth outpost comes here to pick up its supplies, but their convoy never arrived this month. I'm afraid something happened. They need to be found. Just tell me where to look. You've got to be the best friend these soldiers ever had. The route between the outposts runs along Lake Brel. Not the best planning. There's Rackles there, and a Nexus spawning ground in worse. Usually, the convoy's managed by only traveling when the sun is highest. Plus, lots and lots of firepower. But if they're out there too long, well, you need to find them. Every moment we delay risks their lives. I'll leave right now. Whatever happened to the convoy, we need to make sure Morn Outpost gets their supplies. Sonic emitters along the route usually keep off the worst of the critters. But if they're on the fritz, that convoy would have walked into a feeding frenzy. Fix the emitters and see what you can find about the convoy. When you're done, report to Commander Yajik at Morn Outpost. And thank you. Alright, uh, looks like we got a weapon for T7. Looks pretty good. We'll take it. Store these down here, and these down here, this down here. That's no longer any good. Store this down here. Reverse engineer that. Keep this. Okay, and everything else is for selling. Looking good. Alright, there should be a thing right here. Just heal up a little bit. Okay. Um, yeah, it looks like this mission will take us on to the next area. So we definitely want to get down here right now. Alright, that's our next priority is running that mission in the south. However, it does look like we're about out of time. Um, next time, I will be right outside one of these. Oh, that's a big long mission. Oh, that's a big long mission too. Okay. Well, I'll be outside one of these missions when next you see me. I might do a little bit of gathering up here while you're waiting. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Go ahead and click like if you like what you see, and I'll see you next